What's up, everybody? It's your boy, J. Love Nine Street Flame CEO. Make sure you hit that like button, drop a comment, and subscribe to the channel. But let's get into this news, man. The trial for the five O Block members accused in the death of FBG Duck have been scheduled for October 2nd, 2023. Muwap is the only one with a lawyer out of the five suspects. The trial regarding the murder of FBG Duck will start October 2nd, man. Assistant U.S. Attorney Jason Julian said the trial is expected to last for four weeks. That's a month. That mean, that, that could be, that could, it ain't, it mean it ain't looking too good, basically. We got more news for 2K23. <laughs> NBA 2K23 Michael Jordan edition will feature his airness along with a rebuilt version of the beloved Michael Jordan challenges from NBA 2K11 featuring 15 iconic moments from his career. Me personally, I feel like Steph Curry should have been the cover but he might still be the cover. This is the limited edition. Like this is the one that's probably gonna cost a hundred dollars. But you never know. Gotta wait and see. Burger King worker Kevin Ford, who never missed work in twenty seven years, has now received over three hundred K via GoFundMe after a goodie bag video went viral. Wow, that is crazy, bro. Hey, shout out to bro, man. That's that's dope, though. That's dope. See what the world can do, man. When we, you know what I'm saying. But some people are gonna hate, just like they hate with everything else. That's just how the world is. But that's what's up to him. Shout out to Kevin Ford, man. Shout out to Kevin Ford. He's 54. All that hard work finally paid off. More Chicago news. 71 people shot, 8 killed in Chicago during 4th of July weekend. That is crazy, bro. Crazy. Shit is sad. We got people glorifying the shit. Alright, let's get into some sports then, man. Hey, recently, Kevin Durant of the Brooklyn Nets requested or demanded a trade. And now, the fucking NBA is up in flames trying to see who gonna get them next. But, uh, as of late, from what they're saying, his top teams that he want to go to is Phoenix and Miami. I feel like them are two already stacked teams. But, hey, yeah, they were two number one teams in the in the East and West. That's crazy. But, um, yeah, as of right now, no teams have came up with the necessary deal that the Brooklyn Nets won't. For Durant, which I understand they would want a lot, I would want a lot, but uh, yeah, dummy of the day brought to you by some ex convicted felon was arrested after returning to a restaurant to retrieve ghost gun he left behind. Dummy. Officers were called around 4 a.m. Saturday after workers at the restaurant found a ghost gun that had been left behind in a booth by a customer. While the officers were still at the restaurant, the other, the owner of the gun, Derek Sampson, came back to get the weapon. Sampson is a convicted felon. He was arrested for owning the gun and was found with methamphetamine 
and ecstasy on him. His bun was set at fifty thousand dollars. <sighs> fully, fully, he going up the road for sure. <sighs> yeah, dummy of the day brought to you by dumbest Derek Sampson. The meth man, the meth and ecstasy man, the gun using methamphetamine. <laughs> but yeah, YouTube, man, YouTube. Thank y'all for checking this video out. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you drop a comment. Make sure you share this video. Make sure you subscribe and turn on that notification bell, man. Catch us next time. And. It's your host with the Mojo Low Flames, and we are out, bruh.